Pick up on this. Oh, hello. And thank you for joining us here on Attack of the Sketch, a wild and unruly collection of some of the funniest moments from Attack of the Show, both intentional and unintentional. My name is Casey Schreiner, associate producer, unofficial sketch master, and guy with a beard. I'll be your guide through your next hour of television, and what a ride it will be. You'll see cranky religious figures, awkward superheroes, sentient tumors, and a healthy serving of jokes about the penis. It's the rich blend of quality you've come to expect from Attack of the Show, or be pleasantly surprised by. So please, settle into your seats, enjoy the wafting fumes of your beverage of choice, and put down your remote control. I'll take care of all the channel changing here. Now, let's watch some television. Your magic missile has been resisted. Can you tell me what this, this gadget is here, Jess? Hmm. Mm, I love this job. So remember times, wardrobe test 17. Twenty-three. Forty-eight. Seventy-six. One oh three. Two oh one. Two thirteen. Two fifty. Three forty six. Can we see can we see forward please? Mm. Forward. Mm. Forward, thank you. Yup, yup, I think we got it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Back to wardrobe. Okay, thank you. Next time thank you, you very much, there. Pitbull. Okay. <laughs> Sack is the energy drink you can't keep your hands off of. You love to touch it. Sack comes in extreme flavors like Mountain Berry and Salty. 
You love to taste it. Sack restores and replenishes precious bodily fluids. You want it inside you. Sack Energy Drink is yours full. I now know the only way for me to truly study them is to get close. I must become a nerd. This damned thing. Well, never mind, because there's a commercial coming, so now will be a good time to relieve your bowels of all pressure. We don't want you soiling yourself in a fit of laughter. When we return, cereal and chocolate milk for everyone. Attack of the Zoom, baby. Attack. Welcome back, gentle viewers. You know, we have a lot of sponsors. They pay the bills, they scratch our backs, they complain when we say bad things about them. But we only tease the ones we love, or at least, the ones who buy us brandy. Edited by Steve. Not even the great American pastimes are safe from the clutches of video game pornographers. Well, EA Sports, these kinds of lewd, forbiddenness displays were fine in Roman vomitoriums, but they have no place in the trembling hands of our children. The ESRB wants you to think it's okay for children to watch men rub each other in the presence of thousands of people. The ESRB wants your children to ignore the precepts of polite society and hop aboard the all-night train to Brown Town. Don't let it happen. Paid for by friends of Jack Thompson. And now it's time for another Visit Virtual Worlds with Melody Irons. Brought to you by the MMO Tours Board. When traveling through the world of Norath, don't forget to stop by Refuge Isle. It's an unforgettable experience. Whether you're up for touring historic lighthouses or just relaxing on white sands beaches, Refuge Island has it all. Just mind the little ones around the man-eating sharks and giant crabs. For the backpackers in the family, we also have miles of pristine hiking trails and well-maintained campgrounds. Just be sure to leave your food in the locked metal boxes at night or the smell may attract bands of bloodthirsty goblins. And spendthrifts don't despair. Refuge Island has all the best shops and merchants where you can buy unique gifts handcrafted by our native, <laughs> terrifying rat people. Yes, there's truly something for everyone on Refuge Island. Book your vacation today. Oh, one more thing. <laughs> Apple is once again on the forefront of new technology. We're constantly pushing forward, never resting, never content. That is why it is my great pleasure to introduce to you the first ever iVideo Shuffle. Our research shows that 75% of the movie viewing experience is audio. So we cut out all that unnecessary flash and cut right to the heart of it, the sound. 
load up your favorite movies and listen to them whenever and wherever you want. Thank you. Thank you, yes, we're, we're, we're very proud of this. Yeah, uh, nice try, Sarah, but uh, uh, I think I'm gonna drop the hammer on no, you. No, no, no blammies, no blammies! Damn good website. More like damn bad website. Oh boy, look at that. She bashed her head in, right? That looks remarkably uh, like you. We have another caller on the line. I believe it's about the uh, the LCD itself. Hello? Caller, are you there? Hello? Hello? Hey, th hey, this is uh, Ted from Burlington again. I, I had to call Ted. back about I've this monitor. I've missed you, Ted. No, uh, what, what's what's going on, Chad? I had to call back about this monitor. I the don't blame you. The picture on this monitor is so brilliant. Every time I turn it on, it almost sets my house on fire. It'll do it. It'll do it. Burn the retinas <laughs> right out of your sock. I did I that mean. to my ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> you set her on fire, I think? And her family. Enrique Iglesias, Pequeños. Kids, come get your breakfast. Yay, breakfast! Woo. Oranges. Oranges? Mom! Oranges are bull I want something sweeter. Yeah. I want something newer. Yeah. I want something purple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> Too bad all we have are these oranges. Yeah. Hey, kids. Sounds like you're looking for a better breakfast. Sounds like you're looking for Frankenberry. <gasps> Frankenberry is the awesomest cereal ever! In fact, it exceeds your recommended daily allowance of awesome by 600%. I love the fun colors! Dull brown cereal is for old ladies and poor people. I love the great prize inside. Can you deal with the amazing milk liquid CPU cooling system? I love cereal! <laughs> Kids love the great taste. Moms love the 12 essential vitamins and minerals. And with milk, your kids will get 100% of their daily dose of calcium. My teeth are bleeding! Frank and Prairie cereal is part of this balanced breakfast. You win a- Vader, what's up, man? How you doing, buddy? Oh! I don't want a Mountain Dew, I want chocolate milk now. You said you would give me whatever I wanted to drink. Now I said a Mountain Dew, but now I want chocolate milk. Mom, get it. Get it. I want some chocolate milk. I don't want to have to get up. You said that you'd get it for me. That's bull****. That's bull****. up. Ah, the sweet smell of commerce. Now I know you're dying to read that Ayn Rand novel, but please, put it down. I promise what's coming next will be funnier than The Fountainhead. Well, shorter than The Fountainhead anyway. Up next, Wookiee Americans and Breakdancing Deer. Welcome back to Attack of the Sketch. Eight minutes of hilarity stretched into an hour. Now, the northernmost battle site of the American Civil War is St. Albans, Vermont, where a small band of escaped Confederates raided the town and robbed its banks. Now that you've learned something, let's erase that knowledge with some television, shall we? Big up on this. Hey Jesus, where'd you get that donut? 
I summoned it. Which, could you summon me one? I could. crap out of me. Wait, who is that? Someone like you. Someone to rattle the cages. What? Is that you, Brendan? All right, I I have fun up there. Just don't let facilities catch you, all right? I need your help. Someone on the inside is taking a taste. A taste? I don't, I don't even know what you mean. Who runs the damn good downloads? Sarah? Find out what the next one is. Yeah, uh, we don't talk. She'll talk to me. Probably not. You're a, a freak in a mask. Now we're two. Now we're two? I mean, that doesn't... Uh, you do know that I can still see you, right? Doing? You know, the uh, force is strong with me. Strong like a bull, you know what I mean? The force. <sighs> you know, I'm breathing like this because you're hot. And I don't have any lungs anymore. Hey, baby, you want to bump me walks? Mine's furry and small. You ever been to the Death Star, baby? You want to go? Woo, I know the Emperor. We can get you in. No lines. Oh, oh, the Empire strikes out. Skywalking away. Again. Vader not doing so good with the ladies tonight. Sigh. I am going to get killed here. Yeah, all right. I, I think uh, the action's getting a little too hot for me, Probot. So. Probot queries, do you have a sense of sport? I mean, I am still playing, even with this crap I've been dealt. All right, all right. I'll, uh, just for kicks, I'll see your 200 then. Let's do this. Uh, we got the hand right here. Probot cannot keep this up. Not with this hand. What am I, crazy? I'm all in. I've known Chewbac since... Since he was, uh, since he was an Ewok, and this guy, this guy's the best. I remember one time, we were in Vegas, you remember that? I woke up in a bathtub full of ice, <laughs> and then that kimono dragon, this guy rubbed lotion all over my area. Not a lot of people do that. Kaudi. <laughs> I hate coyotes. Some bitches stupid coyotes. I'm gonna kick some coyote ass. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Shut the hell up, you coyotes! I'm sick of you howling at the moon and everything. I'm gonna shoot you! Ah! Ah, my ass! Jesus, is there any more coffee? Not anymore. Mmm. I don't like cream.
Yes, Home Road indeed. Still, to this day, inspiring animated form avatars. Now if I said you'd get a chance to win a million dollars if you kept watching, I'd be lying. If I said we were going to parade both long and short hair Brenda Moran breeds around the studio, however, I would be telling the truth. So it goes, without saying, that you'll remain seated, right? Welcome back to Attack of the Sketch, a mind-bending collection of the most humorous moments from Attack of the Show. If you're just joining us, where the hell were you for the past 30 minutes? Were you watching something else? Are we not pretty enough for you anymore? <laughs> you disgust us. It's a good thing we have television to comfort us. Right now, I don't know about you guys, I'm but I could. I want some lunch. Hamburger sandwich hey, right hey, now. Hey yeah, guys, sushi. hey, it's it's me, Brendan. Uh, is anybody going out to lunch? Do you guys want to? guys want to go out to lunch with me? I I actually brought uh, mine. I, I'm not really hungry. I'm kind of on the diet. I got yeah, yeah. uh, oh, lunchables with a little spread. Oh, those are, yeah, those are, yeah, those are okay. Hot pot. Hot cool. Well, maybe next time then. Yeah. Sure, buddy. Maybe. Totally. Maybe. Great. Okay. Yeah. See you guys later. You want to go to lunch? Oh, we should Ooh, all go together. Okay. You want to go? Let's do it. All right. Let's all go. I love having lunch with everybody. Oh yeah. yeah. Group. I will kill every single one of them. Edited by Steve. I haven't seen many cars, but I have seen a lot of uh, girls just like these on my arms. I'm Brendan Moran, and this is my book club. We discuss the books that matter to you. Sherry. Christine, Margaret, Deborah. It's Brendan Moran's Book Club. Oh, hello, and welcome to Brendan Moran's Book Club, the warm fireside chat of popular literature. Today we're going to be discussing the classic novella by Stephen Randy Davis, C++ for Dummies. I thought this was an excellent book. The language is clear and concise. Language? What am I supposed to say to my fiance to have him stop peeing all over my toilet seat? Oh my god, oh my god, I know, I know. It's, it's, it's so, ew. Ew, right? ew. Middle of the night? Ew. Wait, ew. Wait, wait, what, what do we all think that? about uh, the oh. sections on functions act? <laughs> my Chris is always trying to access my functions. Oh my god, god. I know, I know. You're You're crazy. Crazy. We should talk about uh, the section on syntax and semantics. Gary's cheating on me. Oh my, oh my god. god. No. Honey. I can't believe it. Oh my god. So sorry. It's it's dog. Dog. He's so such a dog. You know no, what? no. It's not your fault. Stop it. Men are pigs. You know what? You it's are not so much you. better off alone. So Bye -bye. You're if we man. could, let's Whoa. just Wait focus. A oh. Wait a second. You don't pay me, man. Okay? You're the boss of us. No. Right. No, stop okay, it. Okay, ladies, it's, it's all right. What to do. Okay, you know what? Okay. okay, all right. What's it? Do? Nope. It's Brendan Moran's book club. Oh God! Oh no! Uh, don't! Oh! Oh! Yeah, oh. 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 buddy, way to do your homework. How does it feel? That's my blammy. Right. Oh, now it's getting t Whoa! Oh, okay! <laughs> oh, all right. Hey, good show, Kevin. Excellent. Have a good night, man. Oh. A storm is coming. Oh, just stop doing that! What did Lane have to say? You said you were gonna talk to Sarah. You're running out of time, Barrera. And I've got all night. All right, you're freaking me out now, dude. Find out what that next damn good download is. All right, I'll find out. Do you swear to God? What? 
Do you swear to God? Yeah, sure, I swear. Say it. Say what? Say you'll swear to God. You want me to say it? Yeah. All right, I, I swear to God, I'll find out. Don't swear to God, swear to me! All right, dude, you're a freak, and you need to stop dropping your toys everywhere. I'm figuring this is yours, so. Thanks. Yeah. Actually, could you get that? Sure, you want your children playing Tetris? Once again, the ESRB has turned a blind eye to this sadomasochistic Russian sex orgy. Smooth blocks, ramming into tight quarters, please. We see right through the pinko innuendo. The only puzzle here is how this multicolored falling brick group fest ended up in the hands of minors. Nice try, you communist child pornographers. Come on, ESRB, earn your keep and ban this deviant fascist sex parade before we raise a generation of Trotskyites with a penchant for leather play and vodka. Don't let it happen. Paid for by friends of Jack Thompson. Mr. Balloonface? I wasn't expecting that twist. There's a lot of anger running through the halls here. Hey, baby, you want to ride the Rancor? Oh, yeah, you do. You will let me buy you a drink. You will not say no. You want to come back to my shuttle with me. The force is uh, strong with me, yeah? Strong like a bull. A bull. The force. I'll storm troop your fortress. Ayo, what do you think, huh? You got any Jedi in you? You want some? Oh. Oh! Oh, you don't want to walk away! Oh, you don't want to give me the finger! Oh! Oh! You know what? This is your fault, aren't you? Huh? You didn't have to drive, I wouldn't bring you along! Later in the show, we run into some technical <laughs> difficulties. <laughs> You know, contrary to popular belief, that valet is actually played by a character actor named Arliss Hutchins. Now, I'd like to be serious with you for just a moment. In exactly two minutes, we will return. Shortly thereafter, you will see a paper airplane, a juggler, a slab of meat, and a lead pipe. Those seemingly random ingredients will come together in a way that will shake you to the very core and make you question all you hold dear. You don't want to miss it. And if you do, please don't say anything. I'm very sensitive. Welcome back. This is Attack of the Sketch, a collection of our show's silliest flights of fancy. Sometimes we do things on this program simply because we can. Arrogance? Perhaps. Hubris? Most certainly. Funny?
the medium of genius. It is the song in a lover's heart and the drug pumping through an addict's vein. It can make you feel alive or it can strip your bones clean of their flesh. But don't cry for film because it is already dead. Wait a minute, what the hell is this? What the hell am I reading here? This is complete rubbish. What are you doing? Get back in there, Maureen. You're under contract. No, no. No way, Jerry. I've done Broadway. Maureen, this if you don't get out of that mic, you'll never work in seen. this town again. What's with that freaking clown anyway? It doesn't make any sense. No, that's it. I'm out of here. I don't... No, I'm out. I'm done. Um, yeah, here's my interesting story thing. Um, last year for Valentine's, I, there was a girl that I liked, so I wanted to give her a card. But I didn't want to give her, like, you know, a normal boring card. I wanted to make it clever, so I took a piece of raw steak and um, cut it into a little piece and taped it onto the card and wrote on there for my valentine a little piece of my heart and I thought she would find that cute and clever, but she didn't. And she told the principal and uh, counselor and uh, I didn't really get in trouble, but I just had to see the school psychiatrist for violent tendencies for about a month, two times a week, and it kind of really didn't work out that well for me. And she still doesn't like me, so yeah, uh, that's my story. I think these are just video game characters. Oh yeah, they're characters, all right. Criminal characters. Curse you, great white male. You may have split me mizzen mass this time, but by Poseidon's beard, I will have your precious ambergris. For the new Attack of the Blog, we're going to bring you the most innovative content from the most obscure physical locations ever. First, we'll need some gear. Oh. As you all know, Elizabeth was in a pretty bad car accident last week. Uh, she's still in the hospital. Uh, we still don't know if she's going to make it, so I thought we should all just Take a moment of silence right now. Hello? No, I'm in some bull meeting. Chicken wings? Yeah, I can do chicken wings for lunch. All right, I'll meet you outside. Are we done here? I have a meeting to go to. Tomorrow is land party day, woo! Yeah! Woo! Peter, yeah! your turn. Yeah! Brennan? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, 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 yes. Oh yes, oh yes. Hey, great show, Kevin. Oh, thanks, Casey. Appreciate it, man. Checking out my VX9000 Sony with enhanced night vision, that's all. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm just checking out my lead pipe 3000! No. Suck up! Ah! 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 Oh, I did! Ah! Suck up! Ah! Office Ahab, so good, yet so ignored by you, the 
ignorant masses. <laughs> Philistines. Now, I'm not through insulting you, so please hurry back. Because sometimes we force our guests to play our silly reindeer games. Is it any wonder we have few repeat visitors? Welcome back to Attack of the Sketch, a veritable cornucopia of contrived contrivances. I'm your host, Casey Schreiner. Sometimes we use the platform of this show to speak out against tyranny, to relieve the plight of the downtrodden, and to be a force for change in this world. Other times, we have pirates fight ninjas. Attack of the show, it has a healthy array. Oh yeah, our stuff from the web, it lasts an hour a day, it sure does. Sometimes they show websites, or sit down with guests, but they will always bring you the best, or try sometimes. Edited by Take a second. I uh, I got I got someone coming in. So, you know, just just real quick. Here, let me help you with that. Oops. You do know there's a pirate out there. Yes. And a ninja. Yes. And they're fighting. Well, what would you expect them to do? When we won the internet, how our flag unfurled, right? When we won the internet, is when we won uh, uh, cornbread. Sorry, sorry, hang on. I mean, I can't even go to the store anymore without just Everybody, yeah, everybody, Sarah, Sarah, you're so awesome. We've had a lot of problems with the ninjas confusing rubber band balls for smoke grenades. Our IT department has been less than thrilled with the pirates as well. Timberball, that we're out of time. My uh, life is full of pain. All right. Bill Gates is walking along, singing a song, throwing money around. What's he doing now? Oh, hello, Mr. Gates. Thank you, Mr. Gates. Thank, thank you. That's what he's doing now. Where the hell did I put that key? Barrera! Oh, God, how did you get in here? I took your key. All right, that's not even legal. Aren't you supposed to be out there solving crimes, not committing them? I'm complicated. I have layers. Right, right. Tell me what you know. All right, I talked to Sarah about her damn good download. Um, she said it's gonna be some backup utility for Windows. A what? It's like a, a piece of software and you did look, that's what she said. Are you sure she didn't say toxic laughing gas? Yeah, I'm sure she didn't say laughing gas. Are you crazy? Whew. 
that info. Yeah, I mean, think about it for a second. How can you even, how can you actually download Listen, that? Ferreira, I'm through with your games. Who's that? Oh, what are you talking about? Comfy? No, I think it's... Yeah, I'm probably just... You probably should just... Yeah, I'm, I'm just... All right. Well, we'll, we'll, hold on a second. Sure. Hold, hold well, on. Why don't you just unlock it? You gotta, like... Just go, unlock it. Well, I'm trying to unlock just, the door. Just, like, nobody's locked. You gotta take your hand off of the... If I hit the button... It's off. Hands, my hands off. Just take... You gotta just, stop pulling. Look. Just unlock the door. Just take your hand off the door! Watching you, Pereira. Watching. Oh, shut up! God. We do hold, as t'were, the mirror up to nature, don't we? Now, you've been obedient little supplicants so far, so let's not test Mr. Shriner's patience. I will deign to answer a few select questions after this. Attack of the Zoom, baby. Attack. After diving headlong into the message board cesspool, I came up for air with these questions. Tedow asks, have you ever made a sketch you thought would be great, but ended up bombing? The answer is no. Nothing we have ever done has ever been anything less than gut-bustingly hilarious. Jungle Toe wants to know what we were thinking with Office Ahab. Well, Jungle Toe, we thought we could make an epic three-part sketch with a full dramatic arc, Herman Melville references, and pump it full with obscure maritime vocabulary. Were you expecting something else? Mushroom King gets all up in our business and wants to know what the most expensive sketch was. Well, I don't know for sure, but the initial budget request for the Brenda Moran's Book Club set almost got me fired. This has been Attack of the Sketch. I have been Casey Schreiner, and you have been broken down and reformed in my image. Good night. Oh, and this is, this is Steve. Hello, Mother. No, I just finished my show. Yes, the, the television show. No, I know we can't all be on Broadway like Scott or Brooke. Look, television is legitimate medium now, Mother. We have our own awards and everything. Computers on Attack of the Show provided by Intel. Game on. Power up. Take control with the Intel Pentium Processor Extreme Edition. <laughs>